And uh, OBS didn't want to work with me. So I'm just going to have to watch another advert to check if this is uh, working for you again. Oh, okay. Resource format not supported. That's that's a new one. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to sort out Twitch. And Working for you again. There we go. We're good. Oh, okay. Resource there we go. We're all sorted. It's all streaming and stuff. We're all good. From what I can see. Yep. I think we're okay. Obviously, let me know if there is anything wrong. But unless there is anything wrong, we'll, we'll be going ahead with this stream. So I'm just going to change over the thing so I can play the game for you guys. And then we'll be getting into it. I will also be uh, loading up the chat on my iPod so I can actually see what you guys are saying and respond to you. Oh god. Ugh. Throwing things! Uh, da, 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 da. There we go. I'm just going in. So, yeah, 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 we've, we've seen this. We've seen this. <laughs> well, Burton, I've seen this many times. Nightmare before Christmas. Oogie's revenge. Okay. Just tweeting out. Okay. We are done. We are going to press the stop button. And we're going to load the game. <laughs> And I'm gonna make sure there's no sound because it's really awkward if you like doing the stream and then this thing comes through. So on the stream I'm gonna be playing this to start with uh, and hopefully it's not gonna do what it did last time to me uh, where it actually, well, <laughs> it, it threw me out and then yeah everything's just like really bad. Okay so I'm now in the chat. So we're all good. Not showing me an adverb. That's fine. Okay, so I know it's 9.25. So this is just going to be a, a little bit of a, a little bit of a, a, a pre kind of a thing. So that's now playing the adverb. That's just great. So, where were we? So we were in grave danger, apparently. So that's the one that we hadn't done. So I'm just going to load this up and then I'll pause it. Uh, just because I know this is way before the stream's supposed to start. And I'll just actually just talk to you guys about what's going on and how this is going to affect the channel. Until 9.25. That's much better. Without my hanging we, man. we did actually see that. That's why I just skipped it. So, now that that's all done... Let's uh, squeeze the sides of my neck and make myself feel a bit weird. <gasps> there we go. <laughs> if you squeeze the sides of your neck, it ends up making you feel woozy. <laughs> okay, guys? So. Let's have a look. My internet on my iPod seems to be really, really, like, slow with Twitch for some reason. And I don't know why. There we go. Apparently I went offline. And I really hope I did not go offline. No, I did not go offline. You're telling me lies. There we go. So now I'm on my iPod. Okay. So I'm actually going to talk to you guys quite quickly until it's 9.30. Um, the reason I'm doing this is because in creating things in post, then editing it, which I enjoy personally, so this kind of is not ideal for me, but in creating it in post and then editing it, and I have to upload it, and uploading for me, because our internet's really bad, takes hours. It takes like three hours, and that's on a 15 to 20 minute video, it'll take three hours, and then if something's like half an hour, it'll take like four, nearly five hours, it's ridiculous. So... The reason I've started doing this is because it's so much faster for you guys, so then I know that I can actually plan to do this. It will go onto YouTube, it'll go onto VidMe and everything, it'll be on my Twitch, you guys can interact with me. And it's like... It's more... It's more quick and it's more user-friendly if you like. I know that sounds really weird 
but YouTube's been a bit of a bitch recently to try and do anything with, so just the fact that I've found a way to make it kind of faster, because I have noticed that YouTube has actually got slower uh, as time has gone on. So, yeah, there is that. <laughs> so what time are we on now? We have one minute left! One minute remaining! Before I fully start playing this game. Uh, as I say, you snooze, you lose. I did say it was 9.30, and when I say 9.30, I mean 9.30. And the cat is scratching at the door, and I am sorry if it picks up me tapping and stuff down here, and secondly, I'm sorry if it picks up fireworks, because for some reason, there is a hell of a lot of fireworks going on recently, so if you can hear fireworks and banging and stuff in the background, that's what it is, it's fireworks. It's okay, the end of the world isn't here quite yet, so... What I'm going to do now is I'm going to change this to just audio only. Actually, I'll change it to chat only. There we go. So it's not going to take up as much as my internet, so you guys get the best viewing experience. There we go. It is 9.30. We are continuing. So, headphones on like you mean business, the biz knows, and let's do this. Okay, so I actually can't remember what we're supposed to do. <laughs> It'll, if you go into the map menu, which is select, so pull up all of the fallen tombstones. Oh, see the Noogie's monsters, then go and see the hanging tree. Oh, God. I remember this mission is a pain in the asshole. <sighs> okay. Because of this. So you may have seen that this is quite early in the game, but we've already got quite advanced monsters. You great big swinging bitch. Oh god! <laughs> Not only did I manage to pick up all of those... Ah oh, crap, it hit me. Oh, we're good. I, I don't care about that one. Get the really powerful one that will probably F you up something, bro. Okay, so we sealed in Oogie's monsters just here. So that's one down. And there is loads more. As you saw when I pulled up the map and it was like circled loads of them. So here's another one. Uh, so yeah, we can pull this one up. I tend to just pull these up whilst there's monsters around because I really can't be bothered to just spend extra time. So more will turn up. So the combos really do work like Devil May Cry. Which I also have to my right. <laughs> On top of my PlayStation. So if I get bored of playing this, I'll play Devil May Cry for you. Devil May Cry 3 to be precise. So let's have a look at the map and just make sure that I am actually getting all of these. Because there's always one that I miss. Yes, yes. Right, so I'm on track, because usually I always kind of forget that there's like one here, but that one, you can't see where I'm pointing, so it doesn't really matter, but there's one that looks like it might be down this way, but it's actually not. <sighs> so here's the next one. I may have got this at a weird angle, so I might not be able to fix this one. You bitch, I hate you. Ugh. Not impressed. Me and my best mate have been watching uh, Gmod Idiot Box recently, and I have to admit, every single time I see something, I just think of something silly, like with a funny voice, like a funny face and stuff. Ugh. I don't know why, but it seems to have really got into my head, guys. It really the kind of makes me think to myself, like, I wish I could do that. I know I could learn to do that. I wish I'd just watch some tutorials. Ah. You. Bitch, you heard me. 
Do the thing! There we go. I'm gonna slap you. I'm gonna slap you to death, bitch. Yeah, this is really quite early in the game. I think there's like 20 chapters, kind of Devil May Cry style. <laughs> I know I keep comparing it to that, but the engine's exactly the same. Like, if I then would now to play Devil May Cry 3, you'd know exactly what I mean. So I believe I've got all of them in this area, but I'm just going to double check for you guys. Always pays to double check. So... Right. There was one just sort of like in the middly area, and that was the one that looks like you had to go all the way around, but you don't, and it's really annoying because I always think that you do, and then I get there and I'm like, ah, I didn't have to. So the next ones are in this next part. The next ones. The, the next lot. Group. <sighs> Whatever. Any hoodle little poodle. How are you guys? How are your pets getting on with fireworks? I've always wondered, like, if anyone has reptiles or, like, birds or anything, like, <laughs> how do they get on with fireworks? I'm sure they love them. Unless, like, reptiles have limited hearing, uh, which I doubt. The reason I'm trying to always get them to go into that, like, green stage is because look at how many points I get for that. <laughs> okay. This song gets really annoying after a while because it's like, you hear it every single time. Uh, and it goes from like, ha ah, to like, oh god, why? Run! Stop. Run! <laughs> right, the next one is on this hill. Oh, I may not be able to pull this one up. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, you piece of... Ah. Why are you doing this to me? God damn it. I'd like to say thank you to the person who uh, retweeted my Live Now post so, on uh, Twitter. Because it's like I posted live now, and then I, <laughs> within an instant, it was posted. Jesus. Okay. That is the only problem with this game, the, uh... Botch. Have some of this! Yeah, 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 yeah! Jesus Christ. <laughs> you could say it was a jackhammer. <laughs> ah, funny joke. It's funny. It's not funny. Right. Are they all dead? Thank God. Right. Now I can go back to my business. Let's pull this up. Up, up, up. And you've got to hold it. There you go. Uh, uh, uh. I know there's one this way. We're just going to go this way. Okay. Let it, let it, let it go. <laughs> just, I'm just like... Well, that was BS. Come on. Come on. Do the thing. Okay. Well, it's going quite well. Oh, she says. <sighs> yes, you are. The only complaint I had about this game is the points always disappear within an instant. Hello! Welcome to the live stream! How are you? Let's pull this thing and do the thing. Do it! Do it! Thank you. Right. Let's just check the map. Uh, Crazy Josh Chu just said hey. That's what I was replying to. So we've only got one more. And then we get to go back to uh, the hanging tree. My nose is all cold. <laughs> it is cold right now, guys. I am freezing. It's not even that cold in my room, but it's it's just cold to me. I'm just I'm always cold. It's because I'm a cold-hearted bitch. That's why. Oh God! Have some of this. Nah. You see, I just killed something in cold blood. It was awful. Come on. Are you 
And slam dunk. Oh yeah. That's not even a slam dunk, but I just said it just because. Well, that was easy. And then let's slay the last one and seal Oogie Boogie's monsters within the whole time. There we go. We are now done. Now it's time to go back to the hanging tree. Right. Hold your ass up, bitch. Go! There we go. We did it. We did it. Okay, doka. Right. We're doing well. We're making good progress. I remember how to do this game. Like, I remember most of the things to do. There's only a few of the, uh... Well, there's no. <laughs> Correction. There is only... Two. Maybe three. That are absolutely evil... To do. Out of the chapters. I, I remember distinctly... When Oogie's monsters approach, I have to I run know. away. Sometimes you may not be able to find you're me, like a bitch. but I'll always be you're back. You're freaking Don't forget. <laughs> There's three of him. It's not like he's just this like one on three. It'd be like three on one if he was to attack just one of the monsters. Think about it. The little one could like climb on the skull's head and like start hitting it. And then the slightly bigger one could like start on the body and then like... The, the main one could, like, punch the crap out of them. You know? That could work. <laughs> okay, hanging tree. And just imagine, like, if the hanging tree just decided to, like, have a go at the skeleton. So he could use, like, his branches to, like, beat the crap out of them. But anyway... Thank you so much, Jack. Now that you're here, Halloween Town will be back to its old self. One of the hanged men just told me he heard a woman singing from under the ground. the ground. What's this? A paper plane from Sally. Down that way lies the underground burial chamber. The burial chamber? It's the largest grave in this area. It's infested with spiders and cobwebs. How romantic. <laughs> That's it. That's where Sally must be. Yep. Spiders and cobwebs. Romantic, of course. Ugh. <laughs> just thoughts of spiders just there. So, we gotta be. Yay. I did well. Uh, I don't need to save, so let's just go next chapter. Next chapter. Oh my god, Amichi. So, the Crypt Creeper. Graveyard. Tomb of Tears. Very nice. Can I go now? Yes. So, uh, uh, where do we have to go again? <laughs> I know that we've got to go to a specific tomb. I think I know where it is. I think it's like, I think it's that big area in the uh, upper right. Yeah, okay. It's better to check than get there and it'd be like, No! You're a stupid person! That's not where you're going! So, before I go, I'm actually going to go back to Halloween Town Square and refill my health and uh, buy some items because this is the part of the game where you're actually going to start to need to buy stuff. <sighs> ah, sorry for yawning, guys. I don't even really feel tired. Uh, Okie okay, dokie. Okay. So there we go, town square fountain area. Do do do. Anyway. <laughs> yep, so we filled up the bottle as well. So let's go and see the witch's shop. And there. And there we go. I love the witch's shop. I love the uh, atmosphere in the witch's shop. Like the uh, the music in the background is really cool. I may actually do a looped version of it if I can find it. This. Uh, I can't remember which one I have to go to. Jack, if you find four crystal skulls, bring them over to the shop and we will exchange them for some goodies. Witch's shop. 
The best bargain in town! Right, big nose. Uh, so I could afford one more crystal bottle, but I'm not actually going to do that. Nor am I going to buy... I'm just going to grab your face. Uh, You'll always be that's very hero, nice. Stop Jack. being creepy. Right. I the reason I'm doing that is because... All that screaming to the next level. <laughs> Shut up! Perhaps I ought to bake some of those Halloween favorites. Bone biscuits. Oh, the dreaded bloody bone biscuit. Uh... <laughs> We'll all find out about the bone biscuits sooner rather than later. We always do. So, let's go. So now that we've, uh, the soul robber is uh, the weapon we use. The reason I went and upgraded that is because we're going to be in for our first boss fight. And it's always better to have... He only does it, I think, if you're actually attacking someone. Because like, he has one last extension, I think. Because we're now like level two or three. I can't remember. Either way, more powerful. So. Uh, where are we going? Where are we going? No, that's where we're going. So, tomorrow I'm going to have to go and do a lot of adult stuff out in town, which is boring. But that does include going to the library and becoming a member of the library so I can actually see if I can use the library to upload my pre-recorded videos. Ah! That's the letter that we want. My arm is itchy. Ow. So. I apologise. Jack, hurry back to town. After you left, Lock, Shock and Barrel brought Ugi back to life. The skeletons and ghosts that are probably attacking you by now are made by Dr. Finkelstein are being controlled by Oogie. These Oogie monsters were specifically made to attack you and will stop at nothing to track you down. Thanks, Sally. Or Captain Obvious. <laughs> you know, it's like, well, yeah, I'd kind of guessed by now. Sally, that's what's going on. So now I'm hauling ass right back to you. Uh, I wish I could just destroy these things. And then... And ah! Okay. I make it... Oh god, nothing else, nothing's easy. This little shit. Why do you always have to spoil our fun? This is the last time you'll get in our way! No, it's not. That's what you think, bitch. <laughs> Slaps him in the face. This channel or Twitch stream does not condone child violence. But to this little shit, I do. Now let's just let's just beat the shit out of this little shit. Right, I'm gonna take these down and get the blue. Because that's going to make it so my attacks are stronger and it's going to do more damage. Get the things, get the things. How you little shit. There we go. <laughs> we got the things and we beat him. I think that's probably the quickest I've ever done that fight. So you hear that that just unlocked? You win this time, Jack. There won't be a next time. Of course not, Jack. Whatever you say. You should just kill him. Seriously. I know he's probably like undead or something, but you should just murder the little shit. <laughs> right, where the hell am I? Oh, okay. It, it put me here. Here we go. Prepare yourselves, guys. It's gonna get spoopy. There's a fluff all over my like keyboard. No, not keyboard. Mouse pad that I never noticed before. Don't bother with the spiders. <laughs> Don't bother with them! Screw them! There we go. <laughs> they steal your money. Uh, the little pickpocketing. Little toe rags. You don't want to get involved in them. <sighs> Sally! <Yeah>. Sally! <laughs> Yeah. Ah, such a heartwarming moment ruined by Spoda. 
put Dino Crisis music right there. Really ugly spoda. <laughs> Any moment now. <laughs> there we go. We did it. No. You bitch! I didn't even get a chance to move, you smell bag. I'm gonna slap your ass, bitch. Right, this is the only way you can actually kill this thing. It's by slapping its ass. And then uh, killing the little spiders. Okay. Okay. Spooners! Kill them all! Come on. There we go. We're doing well. So, you see that that's... Oh god. I suck at the quick time events. Watch it now, guys. Watch how shit I am at this. Oh god. Ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh God! Shriek fight! Have some of this, you bitch! What KO! Bitch slap! It's dead. If only you could really kill things by, like, dancing. <laughs> oh, that would be so much easier. That was probably the easiest and quickest I've ever done that. I'll admit that openly. That was quick. Are you all right, Sally? Oh, Jack, you came back. I got your note. You have to rescue Dr. Finkelstein. This key opens the gate to his manor. Thanks, Sally. I'm glad you're safe. We're all safe. Now that our Pumpkin King has returned. Pumpkin King? Sally, that's it! What's it? I am the Pumpkin King, and I can use my pumpkin fire to fight Oogie and his army. Good thinking, Sally. Thank you, Jack. No, thank you, Sally. Yay! We did it. So, east gate of the plaza to Dr. Finkelstein's lab. Oh, God. And did you notice that we got the Valentine's Day door from Saving Sally? Nudge, nudge. So, let's see what we got. I got A! There you go. I got Pumpkin King Jack figurine. Oh, and lock as well. That's pretty cool. So, I'm just going to quickly save the game whilst we are here. And... Grave Danger, and now Crypt Creeper was the last one. Next chapter! Ooh, ouch. The Doctor's Hutch. This one is a pain in the arse. I would hit the desk, but that would probably cause... Vibrations. And that'd be bad. Okay. So. This is pretty much telling me how to use the new... It's like Devil Trigger mode. And you can have Santa Jack as well, but that's a little later in the game. But not much. So. Because if I do that... Hey presto, so you see that little counter there? 
that's uh, how many things I've got left. So this area is now 100% safe. There's no enemies. Other thing is... There you go. I can collect that. Okay. So. How many points have I got now? Because I believe I got 500. So I've not really got enough to upgrade anything quite yet. But we've got stuff to do. Okay. So now... We can head back to Halloween Town, uh, refresh ourselves at the fountain, and then go and see. Well, Igor and the Bone Biscuit now applies. I always found this game really cool as a kid because, like, I loved Night Before Christmas as a kid. I still do. Oh, yeah, it's uh, it's a Capcom game. You can't just press on things and then things get automatically used. You have to use it from the menu. Let me go in the menu. Okay. Uh, that. And then. Yay! We unlocked the lab. Ugh. The acid works! Doctor's lab, the acid works. Oh yeah. This area is just... Ugh! Hey! Don't want to get hit by that. And here we go. Some new enemies, guys. You're going to want to take that out because it's long range. So once you kill one, they always come in pairs. Oh, they are so evil. Get back here, you... Ugh. You have to do that to break it. Come here. So, let's kill this. Kill it, destroy it, whatever. So as you can see, I've made quite a few points already. So, we're going to want to be in our main form. And then... What does this lever do? Pulls it anyway. Electrocute self. Uh, it turns that off so we can talk to Igor. But first, let's do this infuriating thing where you've got to really, really be careful. And for some reason, it's really, really easy to fall off. And easy to accidentally run. You're going to get some big dosh if you can make it all the way along. Come on. Ah, no. Slow and steady wins the race. I don't want to fall. And you can't go any further than that. That's, that's... That was a frog, I believe. There's frogs here. Oh no, it's Eagle's Grumbly Tommy. That's what that noise was. Where's Dr. Finkelstein? Sorry, Igor under strict orders. Not let anyone pass. But I'm here to rescue the doctor from Oogie. Igor, sorry. But Master says if Igor let anyone through, no biscuits. There you go. Oh, Igor starving. <laughs> the witch shop. You get Igor biscuit, huh? <laughs> okay, Igor. If I bring you a biscuit, You'll let me pass? Yes! Igor do for Jack! Hurry! Igor starving! So, now we have to go and get a bone biscuit. 
But to get the bone biscuit, now we have to go and do a really annoying errand. Uh, right, okay. So we've met Igor. We still have Behemoth and a few others to, to meet, and you're probably thinking, who the hell is that? Well, you'll find out. <laughs> you'll find out, it's fine. Okay, so uh, my throat's getting a bit ragged. Where the hell is my drink? Where is it? Where did. What? Where the hell did I put my drink? Or am I just blind? No, I think I moved it. <laughs> and now I can't find it anywhere. Seriously, though. <laughs> Crap. Oh well. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to be parched then. Right, so. Uh, witch's shop. And whilst they talk, I'll see if I can find it. <laughs> oh, no. Ha! Hey, Jack! I don't think you'll find me as forgiving as luck. I let you win before. Quiet, you. Time for some help! So now we have ghosts to deal with. I just found my drink. Uh, so we have to kill them. Now these are easier if you grab. Because otherwise they just kind of go through walls. And it's really annoying. They just go through walls and go through things if you're trying to like attack them normally. And if you go like between... If you time it right, so for instance with this one, let's grab this one, you see that it's getting close, I keep timing it wrong. So if you time it right you can throw it and that kills it and then does damage to another one. Like that, there you go. So as you can see, this green, glowy one, that's, uh... Like that. There we go. I'm remembering. Because pretty much that's the way you can... That's a king one, that's, that's a... Tough one. Oh, careful. We've only got two more to kill. Come here. This is what I mean by they will run away. And there we go, and we did it. Where'd they all go? Time to scram! Damn right, little toad. I just put my drink there so I can find it. It's just because I'm in semi-dark room, so my eyeballs aren't being able to see all the stuff that's down here and stuff, so I can't see very well. I said stuff way too many times in that sentence. Right, witch's shop, finally! Bone biscuit! Gimme! What's the matter, Jack? I'd like to buy a bone biscuit. A bone biscuit? I'm sorry, but Corpse Kid just came in here a moment ago and bought the last one. What? Witch's shop, the best bargain in town! Uh. You <laughs> I always do that. You'll always be our hero, Jack. I guarantee this will take all that screaming. Yep, yep, that's nice. Time. That's just shut up. Okay, oh, shut up. <laughs> or I'll rub your soul. I'll rub the sole of your shoe. Ah, oh, man. Right. Okay. Let's go and just stick our face in the the 
green water and just really slosh it round. I'm sure it's not toxic or anything. Where the hell is Corpse Kid? You little shit, come here. Talk to him. What? You want my bone biscuit? No way. This is mine. Stop being so snotty. My fine boy. I need that biscuit to save the doctor from Oogie Boogie's clutches. See, Jack's better with kids. <laughs> but this biscuit's mine. Still, I guess you need it more than I do. Oh, yeah. I know. If you can pass my quiz, the biscuit is yours. It's about Halloween Town, so it should be easy for you, Pumpkin King. I need to sneeze. <laughs> Ow! Question I'm good. One. What? Uh, what? The what? <laughs> Question one, the water in the uh, Halloween Tale Fountain is what colour? It's obviously red screen. That's right. <laughs> Question two. What day is Halloween on? Uh, October 31st. That's Question three. What's Jack's last name? Skellington. That's right. Question what is four. the most basic element of Halloween? Chocolate eggs, thrills and chills. That's right. Question five. What is the name of the town in which Jack lives? Hello it's obviously Spookyville or Horrid Hollow. That's right. Question six. That's right. It's five. Question seven. Uh, it's a spider. That's right. Question eight. That. Question nine. That's right. Uh, Question ten. It's definitely not six. That's right. <laughs> Let's unreal a perfect score. Way to go, Jack. A deal's a deal. Here's my biscuit. See, I'm amazing at this stuff. I know everything. Uh, packed with calcium, Eagle's favorite snack. It's pretty much a dog biscuit. And you can get pretty much like calcium biscuits for dogs, which are pretty much bone biscuits. Just saying. So we're literally gonna go to Igor and give him a dog biscuit. <laughs> we're literally gonna give him a dog treat. Uh, anyway, um, back to the game. <laughs> the acid works. Where all of the artists from the 70s went to get their inspiration to write songs. There we go! Is that better, you little toad? Uh, I'm sorry about the sniffing and stuff, I'm actually sick. We did it! I got A again! Rank A or higher, I don't understand that, because I did get rank A, but whatever. Fine, I guess. Ugh, this one. This is the part of the game that's frustrating, and it does just get better, but then there's like two or three later, later in the game that are just like... Now then, Igor, you promised to move aside. Igor keeps his promise. Not to <laughs> Dr. Finkelstein. I know they call him Finkelstein, but it's actually Finkelstein. What was that? Hmm. Where is that thing getting its power from? Doctor, have big generator behind the door over there. Jack Smasher did something to make lightning stop. I bet that won't stop it for long. I'd better get back quick, or I'm fried. Yeah, we have three viewers. Hello and welcome. Uh, I believe one of them is counted as me because I'm on my iPod, looking at the chat. So I think one of them is actually counted as the. That's. Are you kidding me? Bent. Bent you bitch. Thank you. You. Thank you. There we go. Uh. uh, 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 uh this one. <laughs> I had to think. Okay, dope. Doctor's lab, power plant. Yeah, this is definitely the right one. There we go. Maybe I can use this rock. If I grab this rock and take it through the maze, which is a pain in the ass, and smash this junk and uh, shut down the machine. It is literally that simple. 
and just breaking boxes just because I can. Wee! Oh god. Really? I mean, really, bitch? I hate you! Stop that! There we go. Give me all this delicious points. That's it. Ah, oh, yee! Yeah. There we go. Right. Uh, smashing the boxes actually doesn't get you anything. Okay, so let's get the rock closest to so we don't have as far to carry it. Ah, oh, you asshole! I thought it's much. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get electrocuted. Ah, oh, right, okay. There we go. That's the trick. Turn to the side slightly, because when his arm's sticking out, it, it actually, like, catches him a little. Or just hang back a little bit. Okay. Let's go through here. Like that. It's his hand that's forward that actually gets him electrocuted. And now. We did it. Boom! Now we have a timed part. Now, you can... Alright, now to the doctor's lab. Let's just, just go. You can fight the enemies. I usually don't just because I find even if you do like kill the enemies and stuff as quickly as you can, it still cuts it short. And you only have a minute to get up there and that is not a lot, trust me, because this is about to throw a load of stuff at you. Just saying. Like this. Damn you! Okay, go, 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 go. That's no good. Break it, break it, break it, break it. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Through the door, there we go. Because I find that it, it just tends to cut it a little a little too close for comfort, so especially for this playthrough, I don't want to like get caught and redoing crap because that's boring. Good for you, you little crap. Think you can reach me? Try it. It's fun. I know I'm having a ball. I don't want to crush your spirit, Jack. Just your body. That's nice. That's nice. So, I don't think you're gonna make it. strangely enough, I do. Because I've done this many a time. Shut up. Right, this is where you're safe, this area. When you go to that area, you're not. So I'm just going to wait until the first ball goes there and then I'm going to go into that little... Her. I just realised that I could have totally hidden in there. Fuck it! Yay, it's finally here. Go, go, go! And up we go. Go! Yes, I'm fully aware. Shut up. And... You have to be a little bit careful because she does actually do sometimes, like, two. There we go. So we're nearly full health. I wish she'd be... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. That's what I meant. That's what I meant. <laughs> Hello, game. Thank you. <laughs> I'm pressing buttons and you're ignoring me. Now, make me. Right, so I'm just going to be a bit safe. I can think I can still hear one to that side. Yeah, I could. I called it. Run! Run like a motherfucker. Ah. So I can edge to about there, I think. I'll just, like, in that there. Uh, I'm okay with this. I don't think it's gonna hurt me. No, it doesn't. So I know there'll be another one. Come on. Come on. Where's the? Where's the? Yep. 
Uh, I mean, that's not so difficult because trying to get... Ah, uh, shit. Run, running back is not as bad as, like, trying to lift yourself up. Oh my god! I nearly got splammed. I nearly got quished. Oh god! Oh no. So, we've got to really time this one carefully. Go! Move your ass! Now, you need to... Go! Hey! Hey! My god! And then... And then we can go back down and go and get all of the lovely things. I'm sorry, Jack. I was only playing a trick. Just drop Kicker over the edge. Stop helping Oogie. I mean it. Okay. What's it going to take to make them learn? That you just you can't act like that. It's not okay. Okay, do. So, going back down and reaping the rewards. I don't think these like disappear quickly. I know this is taking forever, and I can only apologize. Yes, it does actually. That's just extra special. Right. If that's the case, let's go uh, and get on with it. So, the minute we go up the lift, we're in a boss fight. Just to let you know. Can't go through there as you can see it's boarded up. There is another way we can go. I'm gonna check. I don't think I've lost that many pumpkins. So let's just double check. Yeah, I've only lost like one pumpkin. Okay, let's go. This boss fight is infuriating, by the way. And the music is even more annoying after a while. It's because I was caught on this part for ages. We got B. That's... Eh. Right, I'm just gonna save the game. Some movement out of the corner of my eye and it freaked me. Okay. Okay, okay. Next chapter. Let's go. Changing brains. Oh, how very appropriate. Here we go. Dr. Finkelstein, why are you doing this? Ah, Jack, I see you managed to make it here. You've been busy, Jack. I think it's time for you to rest. Oh, <gasps> Oogie switched your brain. Shall we begin? I think you'll like this device. I don't. I made it especially for you. I hate it with all of my heart. I mean, I have to switch the doctor's real brain back to save him. Let's see. If I open his head from behind, then get in front of him and throw his real brain in. Yes, that should work. Oh yeah, it works. It's just infuriating. Okay. That ah, you're back. Hello. <laughs> Welcome back to the stream. Can only see black though. That's not good. Oh god, I messed up. Oh god, run. Uh, I'm just gonna do that. Uh, let me just switch back to the PC. Wherever I put my control right under my nose I'm very good at losing things that are under my nose apparently let's have a quick check just to see what's going on yep it's just showing black on here there we go that should be okay sorry about that guys that should be okay because it's it's showing up let's have a look 
I know that there's a bit of a lag for you guys, so... Let's have a look, so that should be fine. I'm just watching the stream myself just to try and see... Yeah, it's absolutely fine. Okie doke. Sorry about that. Don't know what happened. It was just being an ass. It was just being an ass. Right, let's uh, go back to this really annoying boss fight. I don't know where I am. Okay, pull, 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 pull. Oh yeah. Botch. Ugh. Why? Why? I hate everything about this. It's just so annoying and difficult. Because of that. Because it just bounces off. Ugh. Come on! Yes! Finally! So let's get one of the brains. Oh god, oh god. Pull, 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 pull. Faster, faster! Uh. Oh, this isn't gonna do it. I just slapped his real brain. That's gonna help. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come. Pull! Hurry up! Finally. Hopefully you can't just only see black. There we go. It's all good. I don't think it was your phone because it was actually on my desktop. Uh, it's just because um, Crazy just said he could only see black. It alerted me. And uh, it's not his stupid phone. <laughs> Because I checked on my desktop and it was black. And the town deceived. Doctor, the St. Patrick's Day door. Indeed, that is a holiday door. Yes. Mm. Check. What's today's date? Why, today is December 24th. No, it's not. It's, the, oh, no. it's November the 5th. It's almost Christmas. You know who I am, don't Yes. I, I do know who you are, don't worry. I don't have amnesia or anything like that, don't worry. Go back to the pumpkin patch. But it won't be easy, because Oogie's monsters have possessed the pumpkins at the entrance, blocking anyone from entering. It's just because um this is going on YouTube afterwards. So that's why I'm explaining. Just so it's not like those horrible streams that you watch and you're like, what are they replying to? Yes, he's making a device to help us defeat Ogi's army. Sorry for all the rest of the Oh my god. What's this? There we go, we got the center up fit. It's Sandy's costume. Oh, that outfit really suits you. I completed the scare device. If I told you what's in it, though, that would ruin the surprise. <laughs> Hide this in your sandy bag and use it to stun Oogie's monsters. So we now have a completely different way of attacking the monsters. Well. Mm. St. Patrick's door. We are good to go. Okay. Sorry for eating on the stream. I've not had any uh, dinner or anything. And, ooh, I only got a seat. Well, that's because I did, as you see, like combo. And they got one, and damage was quite good, but then, like, exclamation count was really crap as well. But that's because. I don't know how you'd integrate it into that uh, cut, uh, cut scene. Boss fight. Hmm. This is one of my favourite levels. Okay, so let's see in the select button. Okay. <sighs> Use 
square to toss. <laughs> Connotations to that. Uh, L2 to spring. Hold longer to throw further. Surprise enemies and return them to their normal state. So you know if you go and use the exclamation mark it makes them tougher? Well this actually makes them untougher, if that makes sense. Okay, so now we just go down the elevator like normal. <sighs> Alright, so we have another way to go here. So if we go across there we can go in that room. But there's like a, a fight that goes on in there, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip out a little bit of this by going Yarr! Boom! We're down here. Because this area is a bit grueling, shall we say. Now I'm actually going to climb up these and get the green things. Just so my health isn't really low. There we go. Just in case. I got attacked on the way back to Halloween Town because I'll just use the fountain. Come on. So there's one that you need to be careful with. I think it's this one. Yep. So you kind of get into a a thing that's kind of like you feel kind of safe uh, and you just keep running and then you fall down a hole. It's like, ah, damn it, no. Okay. Let's get some extra points from this. So this is kind of like the uh, points statues in Devil May Cry. So instead of getting red souls, you get... I don't know what those are. Now I come to think about it. There you go. So we got quite a lot from that. The game is quite good at giving you quite a lot of stuff. This is Sally's kitchen. What does it say? Smells like she was heating some sewage soup. Oh man, sewage soup. That's disgusting, man. What does that consist of? Dead rats and crap. Oh, oh hi, Sally. I don't want to talk to her. I just want to get on with it. That may sound bad. I know. Okay, let's go! The one thing is, he does run very slowly. Right. And through we go! So, now we're going into a different area, and Crazy Just Who says whoop. Yes. We are moving on in the game. We are going and, and we are doing things. Uh, da -da -da. Drink some water. Yeah, there you go. So now we're all sorted. So, uh,. Press it. It's R1. Okay. So now we are dressed as Santa. This is interesting. Because we're going into the behemoth. Behemoth Brayers. Pumpkin patch. So you see these? If we approach these, they're just going to harm us. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. But. You bitch. Get out of here. Excuse me! Come back here! I don't want to get too close! Are you freaking kidding me? Open! There we go! We got him! Now attack! Yeah! Have you all noticed that, like, they can go through walls, but if I'm actually going to throw one, it never goes through walls? Uh, I call BS on that. Come back. Don't you dare get the... Just no. Just no. <laughs> get back here. So there is some more that you have to be a bit aware of because that happens. Batch. Eh! That happens if you get too close. Which is fine. Yeah. Oops, I didn't see that one. <laughs> I was not looking that way. I was looking the other way. 
And it doesn't help that there's other pumpkins around as well that look completely normal. And unassuming. Oh, I see. Excuse me. I'm calling BS right here. Right, I'm going to get to the other side. And attack them from this side, because otherwise it's just going to replenish them. Get back here! Right, come on. Tell you what, guys, I actually watched a really good horror film called The Descent. Uh, I've watched it before, but I rewatched it on Halloween with my parents. <laughs> oh yeah, that's just if you're trying to climb back up. <laughs> now we're going to meet Behemoth. This is the guy I was talking about. Behemoth, the pumpkin patch is a mess. It's the Badens. They ruin it. Break the bridge. The big pumpkin head. Badens eat it too, my precious pumpkins. Have been nibbled. <laughs> Oogie transmission. Hello, testy, testy. One, two, three. Am I on? Yes. <clears throat> Denizens of Oogie Town, Jack has returned, according to the reports. <laughs> he's enjoying our dangerous Oogie Town so much, he's screaming in horror. Rejoice! This is all thanks to your efforts. Oh, Robert! Oh. My star pupil. Bosh! That's how powerful that attack is. Just saying. There's more than half a chance. Come on. Are you ready? Let's just murder them. There we go. Murdered. Right. This is one of my favorite levels. This level's really cool. No, no, no. Because they explode. Go, oh, go. Get back here. Whoa, whoa. Meh, you're being as hers now. Oh, come on. Come on. No. And slap that. But essentially, all he's doing is slapping him with the soul robot. Botch! Oh, y'all, botch! And let me just take that one and throw it at you. <laughs> I will say, for a skeleton, for someone so bony, he's very strong. Terrible joke. Ha ha ha. Because uh, he's a skeleton, oh my god. It's terrible. I hate those ghosts. This is why the ghosts are annoying. Because they just, like, they go in between things and they, they float around, ghostly like, and be annoying. Uh, just out of reach, bat. Okay, come on. Okay, this has got to be the last one. They really... Uh, do you know what? Fine, screw both of you! I don't care anymore! Come to your stars. I am wind running through your hair. Bye, bitch! Wow, that was easy. Uh, they are annoying sometimes. Okie doke, let's just carry on into the really cool level. It's got some puzzle elements, but they're quite simple, which is really cool. It's too early for Christmas. Well, to a score. It is too early for Christmas, you're right. 
But it's not too late for Halloween. Actually, I won't save game. I'll carry on. Pumpkin patch. Barrel's maze. <laughs> no, it's not. Well, I... Want some candy? No, thanks. I've had enough of your treats. Aw, Jack, we're just getting started. It's November. I know, I was like, wow, it's November. That's dedication. Because, uh, um... Crazy's mum's getting her tree up. <laughs> Help me. Uh, I, I would, but... I, I can't. <laughs> Especially can't help you right now. Okay, so. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. Just slap them. You know my mum. Yeah. Behemoth once scolded me for eating one of his. Well, yeah, you. Um. He grows the best as Will says, uh, you get your money worth. Uh, money's worth. I, I guess you would get your money's worth if you did it like early. Save it now. Putting your tree up early. We just put our tree up around the first, second, or third, fourth, or whenever in December. <laughs> Never really do it in November. I don't think we've ever had our tree up early. That I remember. Disclaimer. <laughs> that I remember. I'm not sure. <laughs> well, Josh apparently is never in his house, so thank God. Oh well, yeah, I can kind of see that, especially if you kind of like, it's too early for Christmas. No, we don't need to go there yet. We just need to- I, I remember, I remember. So we get one of these pumpkins, and we take it over here, and you go like this, and then you go, whoop -ha! And now we have enemies. That was like really loud, it clicked the audio in my headphones. No audio has ever done that before. <laughs> I've played games like so ridiculously loud that I ended up with uh, tinnitus uh, for about a week. So. Don't you dare. There we go. I hate you. Oh god, I'm sorry I'm not reading anything at the moment, I'm just like... Let's go down here and uh, take on this big guy. Looks like there's a nice discussion going on. Not that I can see. I'm just like, ah! Right, okay. Uh, chef title uh, for Josh. No life. Uh, Will says nice and just as hell no. What platform this is on? Uh, Will asks. It is on the PlayStation 2. You can pick it up on Amazon for bugger all now. Because <laughs> this is like 2004 this came out. So yeah, you can uh, get it for the PS2 for nothing. I believe it was on the Xbox 360 as well. I believe. I'm not 100% sure. have a look. Uh, okay. So, uh, Will, are you actually playing it on PS2? Yes, I am actually. I'm playing it on a PS2, uh, but I'm actually putting it through my capture card and then uh, capturing the preview from my capture card. <laughs> Can you get it on the PC? Uh, you could if you're willing to uh, use a ROM. You could use a PlayStation emulator and then uh, have a ROM of it. Then you could. No, no emulator. Uh, it is legit. Thanks, ma'am. <laughs> I appreciate the respect. No, I, I prefer to play the original if I can. Like I only use emulators if I really cannot get hold of the original. I think there's now only one game missing from my collection, and that's... Uh, Rule of Rose. Sadly. 
Right. Okay, I remember now. You've got to go up high. Too legit to quit. Yep. No, this is le this is the legit original game. The one that I had when I was seven years old. <laughs> I'm 20 now. <laughs> Just to put that into uh, perspective. This is the one that I left unslapped. There we go. Wait, no. <laughs> yeah, um, uh, Josh says emulators are pain to set up. They are a pain to set up. I spent, I believe, about five hours trying to set up uh, Majora's Mask just to play it. Oh, here we go. It's slapping time! Slappity slap. And slappage. Oh god. No, give me that. Thank you. Super frustrating when the ROMs don't work. Yeah. When ROMs don't work. <laughs> it's like a TV show. <laughs> when ROMs don't work. Yeah, when ROMs don't work, it is just so annoying. Because you're like spamming, like, why doesn't it work? Damn. That'd be so funny if he got KO'd by that then. <laughs> Drop on him. <laughs> Bitch slap me, I will splatter you, like so. There we go. When ROMs go bad. Yeah, when ROMs like give you shit tons of viruses and don't go right. I remember one time I was playing the ROM of Majora's Mask and like everything went slow and distorted and it was actually really creepy and it was like something out of a creepy pasta. Honestly, it really was. I was like, this is spooky. Right, I think I've got to go around this way. I gave up with that, to be honest. Um, I've been on my gaming for weeks now. I'm trying to read that. Gave up on that. Uh, yeah, with ROMs. I gave up on ROMs. Uh, I just decided it was so much easier just to actually play the proper game. I know so many people like to play ROMs, and I have like one or two ROMs of like really rare games that I just cannot get hold of. But even then I don't play them often because they're just broken. <laughs> I'm just like, it's so broken! I swear to god I thought that's where I was supposed to go anyway. Ah! There we go. Now we're progressing. <laughs> Sorry about that guys, I got really kind of kerfuddled and a bit lost. Let's slap the shit out of this. And wow! But yeah. I used to have an emulator of Endurance Mask, but I gave up on it. You, yeah, there's something magical about playing the original, sounding really nerdy now. But you know, when it's like the proper original and you've, you've got the box and everything, it, it just gives you something. PC. Fuck's sake. <laughs> I do like things on PC, I have to admit, because uh, when it comes to modern games, I get PC versions. It's like The Evil Within 2. I've got the PC version of that. Firm believer of the fact that, like, now, more than ever, PC is definitely... I wouldn't say better, but it's just more cost-efficient. Oh yeah. You saw that. And then, oh yeah. Get back here, get back here. No. Yep. No. Bitch. <laughs> PC is getting too expensive for Will's uh, too <laughs> too expensive for Will's peasant taste apparently. Well, I can see why cuz like if you build a PC from scratch and then like you just update what you need to update, it's not as expensive as constantly buying new consoles. But at the same time, It's not so bad. It depends really what what you want out of it. I just don't have the time. Yeah. That's the other thing though with PCs, they are time consuming. If it's a console, you can just turn it on, play on it, and then turn it off. Whereas with console, like, you have that ease of access, but then if you have My brain just shit itself and I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Uh, yeah, if you don't have the time and everything, then PC just is too time consuming. Right, that's where I went, that's where I was. Oh, Jesus. 
and I believe there's nowhere where I can go up there now. My brain is dead. I love cons consoles, simple like me, Will says. Well, yeah, I have to admit, I'm still playing on the PS2 uh, and PS3 and stuff. Like, I, I don't really like any of the games of the PS4 particularly. I tend to be a bit of a horror nut. So, for me, it's not really anything that I'm interested in. It took me a long time to get used to PC controls, I'll admit that. Right, okay, so this is where I've been. Oh, man. Uh, Will says, did you see that Captain Hassey was streaming? Yes! I am so pleased he is back. Captain Hassey is back. Or Hazy? He says it Hazy, but I always said it Hassey, but... Uh, yeah. He is back. The Captain is back. And I was very pleased to see that. <laughs> yeah, I've seen how cool Josh's PC is. And it is really cool. It's got uh, water cooling. And it does look amazing. With all the funky lights and stuff. I say it like you do. Yeah, Hassey. I always thought it was Hassey, but he was like, oh, Captain Hazy. I was like, Captain Hazy? I thought it was Hassey. Oh, sure. <laughs> hey, if you've got it, flaunt it. Right, okay. I think this is where I was supposed to be going, guys. I think. If it's not, I'm going to smack my head against the wall. Yay, it is! I did it. Okie doke. Ugh. Oh, sorry. Clicking joints. Barrels maze. Okay, so we got B, which is pretty good. Okay, so... Crunch time, guys. Do you want me to continue playing this game? Or do you want me to change the game to either Silent Hill 3 or... Never May Cry 3. Uh, Josh's PC has got loads of lights. Mine only has like one red light, but I'm I'm not so bothered. Okay, so I've saved it. So I'm just gonna hang on a little bit and see what you guys what or what. Uh, Silent Hill three or Devil May Cry three. A big fan of threes tonight for some reason. <laughs> Cause I was gonna play Silent Hill three. Did you finish Resident Evil Seven? Yes, I did. Uh, I finished it on stream. It's actually on my channel. Uh, I think I've. I'm pretty sure I made a playlist of it. But yeah, I did finish it. I would choose Devil May Cry three. What do you think, Josh? If we get an overall Devil May Cry 3, that's what we're doing. I love Devil May Cry 3, it's really fun. Let me just take my headphones off because it's getting real warm in there. Whew. Just... Uh, right. Da, da, da. Oh, God. Okie doke. So, I am just going to change the game, if that's the case, to Devil May Cry 3. Okie doke. We have, uh, to be honest, like each Devil May Cry game is a little bit different. This is the one. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, it's all mirrored. There you go. This is the special edition, which is actually slightly easier than the original. But I can't find the original in the town, and I just thought, well, I've got the special edition, so I'm not so bothered of uh, paying again just to get the original. Because I'm cheap like that. <laughs> so, that's the uh, game I was just playing. If you can see it from all like, the reflections. There you go. The Night Before Christmas, Oogie's Revenge. Special edition is definitely better than the uh, normal edition. It's all about lights, Josh says about PCs. Yeah, it is all about lights. Like, with PCs, like, lights make things look special. This must be really weird to, like, just be looking at the, uh... <laughs> Even I have lights. I have lights. I have one red light. 
Red light, red light. <sighs> Flashy Christmas lights. <laughs> I have Christmas lights in my room. I sense there's competition about flashy Christmas lights going on now. Uh, right, that one. Will there? I should buy from around my laptop. Hey, anything you can to spruce things up a little bit. You could even get some like special Christmas tape. Uh, Will could get some special Christmas tape and just uh, tape those uh, Christmas lights on there. Uh, don't mind, choice, I enjoy anything you play, Josh says. Thank you very much. Uh, 60 hertz, otherwise it won't be 60 frames. And just as you should. I always forget that that like, pause is there. And I always sit there like, waiting for it to automatically load and then it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> just end up brain dead for like ages and I'm like, why isn't it loot? Oh, you gotta press start. Sweet dreams. Right. I'm not gonna do the introduction because the introduction takes forever! Um... I'm gonna play as Dante because literally, if he plays Virgil, it's just the same. Just with um, um, well, they used to love Capcom before they did Resident Evil Four. Uh, Josh says they used to be good until now. Yeah, I will quite honestly say, um. I have to say, personally, is this the one with the big spider? Mm. That's the first game. The big spider is the first game, which I have actually played like two parts of my channel. You've heard of it, haven't you? So I'm just gonna skip this because yet again, it's just the introduction that we saw. Well, we didn't see. Now we're into the game. But yeah. Um, Pretty much, Capcom used to make games that were fun, and now they don't. I mean, Resident Evil 7 was pretty good, and I did enjoy Resident Evil 4, but it wasn't horror. It was just kind of a fun shooter. Sorry, not open for business yet. I haven't even picked a name for this joint, and I'm already getting calls. I have to admit, this is like my favourite version of Dante, just because of how cocky he is. It's just really funny to me. Yeah, um, if you want, I can post a link um, before I end the stream. Well, I can go and find it. If you want to use the bathroom, help yourself. Because I back. do believe that I did actually get to the point of fighting the big spider. Spider, spider, son of spider. <laughs> Well, look at those low polygons. He sent this invitation for you. It says, "Come to the party, fuckface." <laughs> this game does action right. Just saying. <laughs> invitation, huh? And funny face incoming. Ah. I just love how Dante just doesn't give a shit that he's just been stabbed like four, five times. And uh, oh my god, fuck that, eat the pizza. <laughs> it's like. Ah, man. That would hurt. This party's getting crazy. <laughs> Let's rock. <sighs> That's how I fix things too, just 
Ah, oh, I just punched myself in the leg really too hard, actually. Dante is off his head. Yeah. Do you know what? I actually did theorise Dante was a stoner. Because he always loves pizza and he just doesn't give a crap about anything. It's just like, just the aesthetics of this game. Just amazing. And then you just see DMC 5 and it's like... Oh no. This is what I'm talking about. This is whooping demon arse in style. It's just like Capcom used to be so good. We're just getting started. Yeah, we're just getting started. Okay, it's gonna throw me in at the deep end, like, just immediately. I love all, like, the voices and stuff. It always sounds so cool. Yeah, as Will says, when they get a good uh, formula for a game, they just go and change it, and it's like, Argh! Right, I usually prefer to play as Trickster or Royal Guard, so I'm gonna leave it on Trickster. But that's just a personal thing. Or Gunslinger's quite cool. Oh, actually, I might go Gunslinger. Gunslinger's really fun. Okay, let's do this. Let's rock, baby. Trixie. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm good at that. But Gunslinger's also... Trixie, my precious... Oh, shit, balls. Oh, God. <laughs> That's what I mean by three minutes of deep end. My precious. Oh god. Though it's actually a HD remake for this, let's just destroy his drum kit. I remember the first time I accidentally destroyed his drum kit, I was like, this is crime. Never destroy a drum kit, it's evil. There's some nice guitars as well. I'm just pleased you can't accidentally destroy the guitars, because that'd be bad. I can't remember what the special move button is. Oh, that's a... okay. Oh, God. I keep looking down and then I keep missing, like, enemies and then I keep getting, like, slaughtered. Is that it? Nope. Blast off! Oh, I missed that. <laughs> He's got a dope meter. He has got a dope meter. He's a, that's that's tri that's just it. He's a stoner. Yawn. Why yawn, Josh? I'm not saying that he's a stoner is a bad thing. I don't mind. Josh is sleepy. Oh, that bitch stood in his pizza. I bloody hell well I'm... I take that as a yes, sleepy. <laughs> Sorry if I'm really loud, like, because I keep leaning over, I keep getting louder. I can already tell. Looks like this is gonna be one hell of a party! Ah, he. There are five viewers. Hello, another viewer. Oh my god, you've been working 12 days in a row without a day off? Jesus! It is nearly 11 as well. Even though I'll probably be awake for like another million hours. Mm. And you're at work at eight? Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah. Yuck. Mm. Just a little. Damn it. 
You guys totally wrecked my shop, and I haven't even named it yet. He doesn't even sound angry. You're gonna pay for that. Thank you very much, Josh. Apparently, I'm the best streamer ever. <laughs> I didn't realize he sneezed. <laughs> now he's pissed. I hope you all have enough to cover all this. The demons, they don't have any money. Brace yourselves for the best music ever. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> well, there's so many weird emojis on here. But my favorite one's the quad damage. I didn't realize there was like quake references of like quad damage. Balls. Uh. Batas. Yes. This is actually way harder to play on a really big TV. I'm actually used to playing this on a small TV next to my bed, so like this is a little harder because there's actually more space to have demons messing around in the corners. There's something, it's nothing. It's like, oh damn! Watch us get blasted. Yeah, I have to do adult stuff in the morning and I hate being grown up, it's boring. More space the better. Definitely. You know. Here we go. Here we go. Oh god. <laughs> This bitch. Well, that's jump. Hey, hey, hey! This bitch. Slappy bitch. Slappy bitch. It's like Slappy Bird, but better. Wait, wait, oh, damn it! Yeah, yeah. Is it just me, or is that scream like really creepy sounding? I know it's meant to be, but like it's really creepy. The Timony Crew. So that's like this place that holds the demon world. Being grown up is horrible. They never tell you that in college, though. I just know they do all the time. Like, oh, being grown up is horrible. It's like, oh, yeah, it's not. It's like, yeah, it is. It's been nearly a year since we last met. Where does the time go? Actually, Dante, it was about three days ago I played this game. No. <laughs> That's Dante's brother if you if you didn't get the you think. No doubt you've got some fun planned for me. Right, Virgil? Uh, yeah, I guess so. That's a big scary flying whale thing. And we did it! Mission clear! And we got A again! Let's save. Mmm, I believe I have some of my old saves on here. Yeah, I do. Ah, damn it, I usually play gold. Oh well. There's not much difference between gold and yellow, to be honest. It's like one difference that I can't even remember. 
Illuminati confirmed. Yep. There's no difference in gold and yellow. <laughs> Why give the choice? <laughs> Devil eyes. Mm. Alright, big nose. I come well. Doesn't to be honest, he hasn't got that big a nose. The him in the groove has revived. It's quite funny, I've seen the like one who people talking on the internet and they're like, oh, Dante and his brother has really big noses. I'm like, do they? The I don't think they do. People are weird. Isn't it a magnificent view? The greatest minds of their time, those who revered evil, constructed this glorious edifice. Don't you mean orifice? Now, after two millenniums of confinement, it can at last fulfill the purpose for which it was intended. That's none of my concern. Did he have it? Of course. Mm. He's taking good care of it. After all, <laughs> share the food. It is the only I would if I could, man. From the mother you both lost. But he has no idea of its true. <laughs> Everyone is weird except for us. Yeah. It's like, oh, your brother like, nearly killed me and stuff. <laughs> That's me when I stub my toe. You start with a scream and then it just cuts off. It's like, ah, oh my god, my toes. Got Doritos. No, I should do. I should have Doritos and Mountain Dew. And weed. And air horns. And deal with it, sunglasses. I'll be there in ten. <laughs> and Josh does know where I live. I like how she says, I found it. It's like, it's a bit hard to miss, love. Great big, like, stone thing poking out the ground. <laughs> yeah, the reason I'm eating, like, vegetable crisps, that might put you off if you hate vegetables, is because I didn't eat any tea or any dinner or whatever. So much like Eagle, I was starving. Well, I am. Cue the funky music. Oh god! No! No! No, oh, you bitches! Fuck you all! Oh, you absolute twat! Come here! Demonetized on YouTube! But it's okay! Because I use VidMe as well! Oh shit, oh shit. No! Oh balls! That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, well he exploded himself anyway. Oh god. I'll uh, have a look at what's been saying, <laughs> what people have been saying in a second. You just gotta bear with me because if I take my eyes off this I'm gonna get killed. Because that's the thing with Devil May Cry, like... Concentration. I've had uh, mini cheddars today. Can only eat pizza while playing <laughs> Devil May Cry. And uh, Will loves mini cheddars as well as pizza. Uh, I'm actually uh, wheat intolerant. I, I can't eat pizza. Now you should feel sorry for me. I can't eat pizza at all. Unless it's gluten free. And gluten free pizza isn't that good. I do like mini cheddars, I have to admit. Mini cheddars are really good. I love the fact that you'd be so destructive. <laughs> so sorry, Mo. Yeah, it's, uh, it's okay. Yeah, it's not your fault, man. You didn't poison me or anything. My body poisoned me. My own body hates me.
And Easter egg. That's pretty damn cool. To be honest, you just kind of get used to just not eating things. I can't even remember what um, things like donuts and stuff, like proper wheat things actually taste like now. I can't remember. So, I, I don't really miss them anymore. For a while I did, but now I don't. It's only when I actually see people like eating them and I can smell it, that's when I'm like, ah. I actually can make pretty good gluten-free pizza. I'm pretty good at it now. Tapioca flour is the best. Because it makes like a nice chewy base, but if you make it thin enough, it makes like a nice crispy base as well. <laughs> Josh is a chef, he can make you them. Yep! Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't think so, bitch, get out now! Easily! There you go. Go make gluten free pizza! Dodging, judging, dodging, the same difference. Uh, it's kind of like Dark Souls on steroids. <laughs> uh, Will says, and Josh says, uh, pizza off. Who can make the best gluten free pizza? Previously on Pizza Off. <laughs> So we've got when ROMs go bad and also pizza are off. What's next? And Dark Souls on steroids. <laughs> I've never actually played Dark Souls. I've seen so many people play it and they rage and I'm just like, if I played that, I'd probably rage so hard I got a heart attack and die. Because like, I lose my temper really easily and really quickly. And it's just like, uh, if I play that, I, I'll probably die of a heart attack from just plain rage. <laughs> It'd be like, streamer, UK streamer, dies of a heart attack <laughs> from playing Dark Souls. So we got a thing. Uh, I believe Josh has played it. Uh, Will's never played it either. I've seen people play it and I'm just like, no, I, I'm not doing that to myself. That just seems like a terrible idea and I'm not doing it. Uh, but some people really love it. Yeah, some people are really obsessed with Dark Souls. I think it depends on the person and like their tolerance for like being pissed off. My tolerance is zero. <laughs> Did you play Amnesia? Yes, I have played Amnesia, but I've not actually streamed it or done videos of it. And it's been... Four years since I played it. Uh, no, I'm not playing Dark Souls 3. No chance. You just want me to die, don't you? If that's the case. <laughs> Play Dark Souls and have a heart attack. <laughs> I smashed my control. I I do more than smash a control. I jump out of the window. <laughs> right. Oh, my least favorite part about Devil May Cry is that when you buy things, if you use them it automatically goes like, oh, you've used it. Screw you. Now we're going to take it from you. Right, I'm not going to buy any more of those. I'll buy one of those and we'll be good. I don't think it's scary, is it? Now, uh, I played uh, Amnesia quite a while ago and I, I found it cool, but it wasn't scary. Uh, and the PC almost went out the window. Oh, man. And then Josh says, come on. <laughs> Yeah, that, that'd be bad. Like, I wouldn't want to throw my PC out of the window. I've nearly thrown my laptop out of the window like three times in my life. I love this uh, cutscene. This cutscene's really funny to me. Come on, Fido. Bring the slippers. No one will get that. If someone gets that reference, I love you.
looks like someone annoyed Fluffy. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> rattled Fluffy's chains. <laughs> about that when I cry. Easy, Fido. How about I take you out for a walk? Come on, puppy. Let's go. I think they did do a... They need to do a new one, yeah, and they need to kind of take it back to how it was. And you definitely cry for the PS4. Oh, God, yeah. Outlast. The last bit of Outlast, that was just... Oh. I nearly broke your wrist. Watch me suck at this boss fight. No! Fucking shed bars. Yeah. Get back here, you bitch. easier if you use the hand, the ebony and ivory for this shit. Ah, oh, damn it. As you can see, I'm really taking health down. Because it's gunslinger as well, so he's like more powerful with the guns. This is the only way you can really succeed at this boss fight, to be honest. And like, I'm really good at mashing buttons. I was gonna say, is one of the heads already gone? They'll start leaving soon. Fuck. Uh... Oh, I remember when you had to finish out last for me when I broke my wrist. Yeah. I remember that. <laughs> And uh, Wilson's old school. I love Outlast. I actually did a Let's Play of Outlast on my channel. Oh my god. I don't want to aim at that. I want to aim at the head. 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 Ah! Damn balls. Ooh, I'm getting the shit kicked out of me now. Shit, I jumped into both of those. There's only one head left. Oh, my wrist is burning. I'm gonna have to sleep soon. That's okay, man. Who knows? I'm not even sure. I think probably at about half past eleven I'll stop. Because it's quite a big stream. I acknowledge your ability. Take my soul and go forth. You have my blessing. Here we go, new weapon. <laughs> Okay, so we've actually got a new weapon, so as you can see, we can change our guns with um, L2, and with R2, we can change the sword, all those. Yeah, I need to catch up with you, I really do. I need to catch up with Josh. Because, like, I've been just, I don't know, I've not been on Messenger for ages. Are you 
going to the party? What's the hurry? Didn't you get an invitation? Oh, she pissed. I'll throw you my number. Yeah, that'd be better, because I usually text, I prefer to text on actual text message. <laughs> this game is crazy. This game is crazy, and that's why I love this game. This one's one of the crazier ones, and it gets even crazier as time goes on. This just keeps getting better and, and it better. does. Dante said it himself. Um, I think I'll probably stream this game, and both of the games, so I'll probably stream then before Christmas and I'll stream this and I think I'll actually complete both of these because I have to admit I'm actually having quite a lot of fun playing them so let's have a bit of a save uh, I'll try and figure out when I'm next free and then I'll set up, I'll set up an actual event it's just a little bit easier that way so it's not like oh crap because that way I know when I'm streaming you all know when I'm streaming and then it's easier. I might even stream um, Haunting Ground on hard mode. Because I played it on normal mode years ago on my channel. Looks like we have an uninvited guest. Is that so? A human. A woman. A woman? I'm afraid I should ask the uninvited one to leave. That is what you want. Actually, I happen to be acquainted with that woman. A storm is approaching. <laughs> well, that's not good. Your manager isn't happy. And uh, Wilson's Haunting Grand sounds familiar. Yes, I played it when I was. I think it was like one year into my gaming channel I played it. I was like about 16, I think. And it's one of my older ones. Um, Capcom game again, around the same time as this. I think it uses the same engine, actually, if I remember correctly. But it's really good, but I might play it on hard mode, because hard mode's difficult. <laughs> it is really difficult. But yeah, I will check Messenger later and uh, get your phone number. Because uh, I, I prefer to text. Uh, but my actual text messaging and stuff. Uh, wrong place. Oh, I'm still getting used to the change in camera angles, I swear. Right, we can't go through there because, as you can see, there's lots and lots of flame. Hard mode is hard. I know. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Well, Captain Hassey may be back, but uh, I'm Captain Obvious. <laughs> Damn you. Oh, my God. It's because I was playing this and I couldn't think. Hard mode is hard. <sighs> what do I, for f <laughs> I need to stop looking away. Oh, fine. Fine. <laughs> yeah, I know. Hard mode is hard. Hmm. I wonder why. <laughs> there we go. I just got the message. My number. My hunger. Whoops. <laughs> Tire power. Uh, I believe I need to go through a yellow door first. I don't need to go that way. The ambience of this game is really weird because like you can hear voices in the background. Ugh, right, fine. I've gotta go through the blue door. Fine, 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 fine. I'm going through the blue door. I'm going through. Yeah, not my finest moment. Hard mode is hard. <laughs> Yeah, this game's crazy. I mean, I've played it on hard mode once and, like, it was insane. Hard mode on this game is, is not hard. It is insane. It's just, like, ev there's just millions of enemies and they are so fast as well. Uh, funky music again. Stop that bit. Stop that! Ugh. That's cool. Yeah, I know. 
it's just one of those things. It's like you say stupid things when you're not fully concentrating on what you're saying. It's like playing a horror game. Oh, it's dark. No shit, it's a horror game. Of course it's dark. Streaming is multi Yeah, it is multitasking. So is just doing Let's Plays in general because sometimes doing kind of walkthrough kind of gaming videos is actually really quite taxing because you're trying to explain what you're doing whilst fighting enemies and stuff. Because I remember when I was playing Haunting Ground trying to explain exactly what I was doing and, 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 and what was going on when you're being chased by something is uh, quite difficult to say the least. I'm quite good at multitasking, same as driving. Weirdly enough, I play computer games and I make a good driver. <laughs> Let's get loads and loads of points. Come oh, on. What's wrong, Josh? I can just see sad emojis, I think. I tell you what, from playing this game, you get used to hearing blast off. So many times. Is it this one? No. I think there's another one. Harder than Dark Souls? I wouldn't know. I've not played it myself. I mean, it looks like Dark Souls is probably harder, but I'm not sure. Mm. Oh god. Hello. No, you don't. When you see them inhaling like sand or dust or whatever, means they're going to try and make themselves more powerful. Gunsling is really cool because you can shoot behind yourself as well. No, 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 no! You a bunch? No! Make your stand. Come on. This game has a really cool soundtrack. I actually do listen to the soundtrack in my spare time as well. Just so you guys know. <laughs> um, I actually have an extended soundtracks channel, uh, which extends soundtracks from games like this. Uh, I do all the editing and stuff. Uh, I believe we just keep going up. I believe. Oh yeah, I remember this one. Right, watch me fumble. Uh, uh, no. Uh, 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 come on. Come on. Uh, come on. Come on, you wretch. <laughs> Yay. Yellow door. There's the yellow door I was talking about. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish off this uh, chapter. And then... Uh, eh. Channel on YouTube. Yeah. Uh, I'll put a link up as well, so I'll put a link to um, the Devil May Cry 1 playlist I did, and also the other channel I've got, uh, which is literally just called Extended Soundtracks by Mog. Um, you know you wanna. Try it. No! I'll die of a heart attack of just anger! Oh god, god, god! Uh. Gotta keep moving. Make your move. You know you wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna try Dark Souls. Oh god, that's really bright. Oh no, Captain Obvious. 
Oh, I didn't know about the music one. That's all right. I'll post a link to it. Ah! Attack! Boss fight! Attack this piece of shit! Attack! <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Oh god, I can't see anything. <laughs> Where am I? What's going on? I can't see. Okay, now I can see. probably hear the control of my brain <laughs> from me like firing madly the best way to do this is actually by standing up here and then waiting <laughs> here we go so as you see that does loads of damage Got some funky ass music. So if you go on its back and then do this, it really messes it up. Come on, I think I can do it. No, you bitch! Get back here! Yes. I haven't even got past the first boss five hours in. I can well imagine because I've seen videos of people playing Dark Souls and it's like, it looks really difficult. Uh. Uh. What am I doing? Oh, okay. I was thinking, what's going on? Astronomical board. Uh, the gastro astronomical board. I just said gastronomical. <laughs> Uh, which is supposed to be the endless void, be, uh, said to be powered by time. <coughs> Cute, funny. Cutscene. I love that. It's like, what the hell? There's no need to use violence, devil boy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Better listen to what I have to say, lad. This tower here is very sturdy. You see? Your tricks will do no good. No good! Zip it. Or I'll pierce that big nose. That could be a problem. Just hear me out. You've got nothing to lose, right? My name is Jester. And I know a thing or two about this place. That thing there is a power generator for this entire sector. In order to open the door, you'll need to apply a little something to it first. Do you know what that is, kid? Or is that too difficult for you? <laughs> Get to the point, or you want to keep on dancing? Actually, I prefer a sword to be my partner. May I have this dance, my lady? <laughs> Apparently Josh will pay me to uh, play Dark Souls. <laughs> How much are you willing to pay me? Is. Remember that kid? Write it down on your hand if you don't trust your head. I see. Thanks. 
You still piss me off. Though. Oh my god, he swear. Lol. Oh wow. Oh, after what? <laughs> Damn your price, Josh. How much are you willing to pay me? <laughs> uh, that's where I was. Okay. So I finished that chapter. So what I'll do now is find the uh, what do we call it for you? The links. They're the word. They're the word. That's the word. God, you can tell my brain's going. Uh, right. I'm just gonna find the playlist first. One moment. Created playlists. <laughs> YouTuber problems. When you make so many playlists, you're like, I don't know how many there is. Devil may cry. Oh, apparently there's three videos in there. Mm -mm. That is one. That's the Devil May Cry one. And now I will find you the other channel. It's literally called Extended Soundtracks by Mog. <laughs> uh, it's my old channel, but I actually revamped it. So it would be um, Extended Soundtracks. There we go. You'd pay me 30 quid. Call it 35 and I'll do it. <laughs> Won't haggle! You always haggle. Whatever happens, haggle. That's my wisdom for you all. That's my wisdom. As long as you don't- I won't smash your PC. For 30 quid I will not smash your PC. I uh, won't smash your PC and I'll play Dark Souls. And that's a promise. There we go. So. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. I pressed a button. Okay. So, this is a little bit of the end of the stream. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Tonight was really fun. Uh, thank you all for being here. And uh, I'll see you again very soon. Uh, I'll keep uploading The Evil Within 2. Don't worry. And then once I've finished uploading the three parts that I've got yep three parts once I've finished uploading those then I'll be streaming it so I think I'm gonna make a Sunday stream kind of a thing at about 9 30 just because then it's late enough in the day for the internet to be okay and all of that business so thank you all very much again I'll see you very soon Take care of yourselves and the ones that you love. Bye-bye!